I'm John Bradbury and welcome to John's Metal Detecting Adventures. Look at this surrounding area, up by that 17th century hall, in the middle of the uh, field, just here, yes, and I'm just uh, working above. I'm working away, the footpath's down there, and I'm just above the footpath, in this little bit of a groove in this wall, as I use this as a marker. And all the way to that tree, where, to the right hand side of that tree, is all the footpath, and I'm above it. Huh. A sideboard clock key. Fifty two. So it could be. Oh, that's a coin. Oh, that's an unusual one. Medieval plumb line. Medieval plumb line. Look at that. Mm -hmm. 73. Just there. Oh! Oh, what's that? Oh, that's interesting. It's a brooch. Oh, it's silver. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, my giddy aunt. That is just wonderful. Lovely jubbly. Oh, wow. Look at that. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, yes. Ten minutes on this field. Continued in the middle of the field, working my way to the footpath. Oh yeah, look at the, it's a fern, it's a fern uh, design. This one's cleaning up though, of course. But that is silver, definitely silver. And that were a cracking signal on the Equinox 900. That were 83. Well, <laughs> it would be, wouldn't it? There's all marks on there. I think it's Victorian, personally. I think it's Victorian. That's what I think it is. But what a cracking bit of kit that is, though. That is really, really nice. We're still getting the silver, and we can't complain. But that'll do nicely. So, one coin, George III, half penny. And then this came out. <laughs> oh, don't you love it? Beautiful, is that? I bet that's going to come up really nice when I clean it up and get all the muck off. That'll be beautiful. Then I'll get the old marks on that and check out the exact year. That would be awesome, absolutely awesome. Nice bit of pottery, I think it's uh, 18th century, glazed on one side. Quite a big pot. I think it's a big thing, whatever it is, don't know what it is. I don't know what that is. A uh, bit of a military button. 42. Military button. Infantry, I think, Second World War. Aha, uh -huh. 77. Horse, uh, horse brass decoration. Yeah, horse brass decoration, 77. Brass. To a rim of uh, some pottery there. So I think around about 17. 18th century. Maybe a little bit older. 17 to 19th century then. A rim. A rim of something. I'm smiling! I'm smiling! I'm smiling! I'm smiling! Yes! I found something good again! <laughs> Superb! Brilliant! Absolutely awesome! My giddy aunt! Unbelievable! 
Well, absolutely got this one. But this, I'm just by this tree. I'll uh, give you a bad tree here. There's a footpath running on here. And, and, and I've been on this footpath quite a few times. And don't ask me how I missed this one. I have no idea how I have missed this. Check this one out. Superb old oh, man. Hey, look at that. That is what you call a coin. Look at that coin there. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. That is a coin. That is a big coin. Absolutely ginormous. Okay, it's not in perfect condition, but I'll tell you what, I'm happy to get that. Look at the size of that one. Look at it. Uh, I think it's 1836. Lovely, lovely, jubbly. What a big coin that is. That is nice. That is a very nice. I've only been here half an hour. <laughs> yes, I'm enjoying this evening. Silver brooch, maybe Victorian. And now this. What else is here? What the heck else is on this here? And I've, been, I've done this on this footpath so many times. This machine is awesome. Equinox 900 with a 15 inch search coil. Awesome, man. What a machine. What a combination. Look at what I've been finding. Look at my videos. Absolutely superb. Honestly, superb. Well, detecting day comes so close. Done about three hours detecting. Had a brilliant time finding artifacts and coins. Brilliant.